With snow, sleet, and ice all a big concern over the next 48 hours, families across our area are scrambling to get prepared. Tonight, our David McNally is on the road right now after making the trip south to Bartholomew County. He's live with what people were busy doing tonight to make sure they're ready to hunker down inside tomorrow. David. Andrew, hey, take a look out the front window here. We're northbound on I-65. We're just over Lafayette Road here. And yes, it's very shiny, this roadway, but this roadway is not slippery. But we're going to have a very different situation as Andrew as Andrew was looking for those temperatures dropping as they will. And due to turn to freezing rain, setting up an unsettling morning commute. Thursday night in Hope, Bartholomew County. Hoping they're ready. Well, I got the ice melter already at home, and I prepare early. <laughs> We're in the line of uh, four to six down here. So Pastor Ed Cottrell picked up oil for his snowblower. If it gets real wet, it ain't going to handle it. It's going to go back to the shovel. We have all the shovels, and we have a few toboggans, some sleds. At Major's True Value, they've had to restock ice melt. I think just wanting to prepare, you know. If it's supposed to get as bad as what they say, then you just want to prepare and have what they need. They know that what was falling as wind pushed rain Thursday evening is forecast to turn to freezing rain overnight. Stay off the roads and stay at home. To do that, folks pack the Dollar General now. I like milk and bread and eggs and stuff like that. And she had a real important thing on her list. And my mom's dying of cancer and in her lungs, and so I come down here tonight to get her some pudding and stuff because she likes to eat it when she takes her medicine. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. You have a great evening. At the Swiss-made country market on Hope's Town Square, a busy day. I hope all that weather is coming this way, but, you know. I need two pounds of this. I'm sorry. Bread and deli, cheese and meat, probably. Getting stuff for work and stuff throughout the week just in case it gets worse. Hey, you have a great evening. A great evening. How great the morning will be, hard to tell. We'll, just, we'll be covering it for you, of course, from out on the street tomorrow during sunrise. Reporting live, David McAnally, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.